Hi, my name is Gerhard Meinland. I'm uh, the owner and manager uh, of the BNS company in Markneckirchen, Germany, and I'm in the seventh generation making musical instrument, actually brass wind instruments, and I'm very happy to be here in Malcolm McNabb's studio in the United States, and um, I'm also very thankful the, for the collaboration we are having together. So Malcolm is nearly on every uh, soundtrack of the Hollywood movies, and in business for 40 years, Malcolm, isn't it? I've been doing it for about 40 years, and I've done a lot of movies in 40 years. I say maybe about 2,000 or over 2,000, probably. Can't count them now, but yeah. And it's, that's a lot of years to be dragging your horn to work and not knowing what you're going to have to play. But, you know, the tools become very important, of course. And in our collaboration, we've come up with some good tools for me to use. So, but actually, remember how we uh, met first time and how you do. encountered uh, the possibility of playing a BNS Challenger trumpet. I do indeed. I remember there was a, something about a big horn hangout up at Vince Rosa's house and, uh, and I thought, oh good, can I go up and videotape and uh, videotape and then by the way, these guys need a ride back to their hotel downtown. So the driver took you back and that was me, you know, and then we, we didn't know each other. That's when we first met. And then later, I guess uh, someone mentioned, you know, the, you know, the driver is a trumpet player. Really? <laughs> so that's how we found out we started uh, talking, you know, about things. And um, I, I was pleased because of the, the work that Vince DeRosa and Myron Bloom did on developing your Hoyer horn with you uh, the right way with a lot of feedback from players, people that are really using them, professionals. Um, this is the way you developed uh, a pretty darn good instrument. And then when I heard that we could do the same thing with trumpets, I was very excited to be on board.